Okay folks, welcome back to the challenge San Andreas. Now before I continue with the missions, the mod creator has sent me a gift. I have received my own personalised vehicle. And I believe it's the Cheetah Forza which has had its uh, design changed for me. Let's take a look at the Cheetah Forza which is just over here. Yes. Yes indeed. Shut up. <laughs> My own crazy for games Cheetah Forza. Yes. So this is my first time seeing this car in the game for myself. Uh, the mod creator, Polyvalord, did uh, send me a picture of this car, but again, this is my first time uh, seeing it in the mod. Wow. I love it. And not only that, but uh, the pack that he sent me also contains a new shirt which you can buy at Binko. Binko in San Fierro is just there. And I think this car has also been added to the uh, personalised or personal vehicle option in this mod, which I still haven't tried yet. Let's take a look. So I think um, one of the shirts is called uh, something new. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Yeah, special t-shirt, that's it. Behold! <laughs> nice, nice. Thank you, sir. No, thank you, Polyvalord, the mod creator. Many, many thanks. I love it. Right, I'm going to... Uh, get the blue jeans back and uh, a different pair of shoes. I'll also uh, take the mask off later on too. Right, so my plan for photo opportunity is, uh, hold on a second, uh, black, just the ones that CJ wore at the start of the game. So, um, uh, no, I don't. <laughs> right, so I want to get some more Molotovs because it could make uh, some of Woozy's missions easier in this mod. You never know. Uh, so, I'll start Photo Opportunity and I'll meet up with Caesar, but I'll kill him and then I'll head on over to LS and get those Molotovs from Jefferson, I think. And then I'll fast travel back to Fierro and then save. And then when I start the mission again, I will have a trip skip. That's right. I'll also get that free armor from RS Hall while I'm in Flint County. <clears throat> oh, bugger off. It wasn't me donut munching FUD. Lag. Right, I made a backup as always. Right. I'm very curious to see how uh, this mission is affecting this mod. Cool. Right. So that Cheetah Forza, as in the Crazy for Games, Cheetah Forza is uh, always going to be there, as far as I know. Ah, I forgot to uh, tell you what. Let me check out the personalised vehicle feature. So I think it's a uh, tab and G that you hold. Hmm. Was it tab and Y? Hmm. Not sure. I'll have to uh, step into that little red marker on uh, Grove Street again to find out. 
Now, unless uh, the drive to uh, Flint County has been changed, I will speed the video up until I've met up with Caesar. See you there. Oh, I literally just noticed he's up there now. Ooh. Okay, I assumed he would, uh, you know, be... I think it's over here where he usually is. Okay. Hmm. Well, I'll tell you what. I've uh, come this far. I might as well go the rest of the way to Los Santos. So I'll speed it up until I am in Los Santos because there's something else I want to do over there. So what was that something else you wanted to do in Los Santos? I want to remove the mask and... Oh. Let me see. Ah. Oh wait, hold on. Is that not a hat? That mask. It is. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. <laughs> I was under the impression that the mask was uh, under the shades category. That's fine. Because I wanted to put those uh, shades back on anyway. Cool. Joe Cool. Hashtag Snoopy and Peanuts. Right, I'll get those Molotovs and I'll head over to see Caesar. I'm considering uh, getting the trip skip anyway. I, I was thinking about not getting the trip skip, but I'm thinking about getting it anyway. Because, um, given where Caesar is now in this mod, I have a feeling some uh, nasty shit is going to go down. Yeah. It might not, but you never know. Right. So, should I continue taking the train tracks to get back there? I think I'll uh, take the roads. Also, thanks to those of you for reminding me about the uh, inside... Another lemming. <laughs> Yeah, thanks to those of you for reminding me about, um, yeah, thanks to those of you who reminded me about the inside track betting trick that you can do to get a fuckload of cash quite easily and also at the very start of the game, well, almost at the very start of the game, you have to uh, uh, buy a safe house first, well, that's recommended anyway, strongly recommended. Yeah, how it works is... Go to either of the uh, betting shops and uh, bet all of your money on the horse with the worst odds. And just keep trying it until you win. And the reason you want to buy a safe house nearby is uh, to allow you to uh, keep reloading your save if you uh, lose, obviously. One sec. Right, I'm back. It was a bit loud. I'm going the right way, right? Yeah. No matter how many times I play this game, I always get lost in the countryside. Okay. Right. I mean, given that Caesar is um, 
not in the usual place. I wouldn't be at all surprised if the trip skip doesn't actually work this time around. Woof woof. That's my upstairs neighbour's dog again. He quite often gets quite excited when you let him out. Right. The triumphant arrival. Ah yeah, this place. This is where Torino's quote-unquote helicopter lands if you take too long. Oh god. Six stars playthrough memories. Bad ones. Uh, right, that's the same. Well, we don't have uh, far to go, right. Uh. Mm. Hold on a sec. Hold up a sec, fellas. Okay. Just don't tip Caesar's car over. Hey, if I do, I'll head back and save and maybe, just maybe, there will be a trip skip. Okay, remember, vehicles handle a bit differently in this mode. And uh, to make matters worse, I'm driving a lowrider. We all know how uh, bad they are when it comes to handling. I wonder if I could uh, take a shortcut across the grass. Of course I can. Corsica. Yeah, this is fine. Well, uh, so far, everything's fine. I was going to say, apart from uh, the new pickup location, but that's not bad. It's a lot closer than what it is in the vanilla game. Yeah, this mission was changed pretty late in the game's development, as far as I know. Yeah, originally you were supposed to take the photos from a helicopter, a stolen helicopter, but it was changed late into the game's development and uh, they didn't have time to get the voice actors to re-record their lines, which is why they're shouting in the final version of the mission. Right. Right, will they be in the same places and do they take less time? There it is, Holmes. Yeah, maybe we've got a smaller window of opportunity to uh, snap the. This business is bigger than any gang, little Okay, so far nothing's different. Again, apart from Caesar's pickup location. This guy take himself real serious. That's T-Bone Mendez. What now? Is that it? That's everything, Carl. Christmas still depends on you. Hey, who's the gringo? I don't like the look of that guy. This more than a few thugs pushing product. It's a serious organization. How many of these clowns are there? Honk, honk. Ah, I know a pimp when I see one. They being clever about this. It ain't no exchange of nothing incriminating. Oh god, guess what mission is coming next? One of my least favourite missions in this game. Motherfucking Jizzy. I'll fast travel back to Doherty once this is over. That was some heavy shit! We better split up and get out of here. I'll meet you back at the garage, eh? Coolio, we got what we came for anyway. We certainly did. Okay. I did get an auto save, right? Sure did. By the way, I had another look at the README file. Um, 
Another mission after which you shouldn't load your autosave file is Monster, because uh, technically that's a race mission as well. Right, uh, no, wrong one. This one. Oh, I forgot to uh, check out the personal vehicle red marker on Grove Street. Maybe some other time. It's not the end of the world. God, I just love red and black cars. And fun funnily enough, I do have a red and black bass guitar. Looks like a car that Darth Maul would drive. And funnily enough, uh, the actor who plays Darth Maul is also Scottish. Just like me. <laughs> okay. Nice one, CJ. Here we go. Now then. Uh, right, hold on a tick. Uh, no, you're okay. Forget about it. I was going to uh, put that motorbike in my garage. But I remember that the hotel where you uh, encounter the preacher is pretty far away from the garage, so uh, don't bother. Uh, Stu? Yes? Why did you put one of these in your garage when one spawns just across the road anyway? I don't know. I just did. Quack. Normal. Who the fuck wants to be normal? Not me. Sometimes I try to be normal, but it gets boring, so I go back to being me. Yeah, being normal, that's boring. Righty ho, governor. I should still have my uh, regular rifle. Yes, I want to do T-Bone Mendez before I move on to the missions for Woozy. So I'll be using the rifle to take out the bikers early, hopefully. So, uh, as you saw during a photo opportunity, not all the missions in this mod have been made more difficult. Now, the download page specifically says um, some of the missions have just been changed in some way, shape or form, and not necessarily um, made them harder, you know? It's not necessarily the Necessarily, the difficulty that's, that's been affected Later, or changed. Hey, Jizzy, it's Carl. I just dropped off your girl. Check. Okay. I bet this pimp has uh, something a bit more powerful than just a regular pistol. Do I smell a rocket launcher? Possibly. Right. Shit on a shingle. What a shame. Poor shingle. I've got plenty of time. I'll uh, use the camera to zoom in and see what gun this twat is packing. Right, uh, nothing at the moment. Unless he doesn't equip it until you get close enough. I could probably snipe him from here. Here comes my player, now you in real trouble. This is my track, sucker. You suck, bitch. Her health bar run down quicker. 
Now, regarding the Preacher, I bet this time around there are gunners in not just the limo, but the Huntley as well, you know, the protection car. Why is her health bar not draining? Should I be worried? Uh, oh, I forgot about this crap. Right. Uh, okay. It's okay. It won't disappear. Shots, come on. That's the way. That's the way you do it. Money for nothing and your chicks are free. In the case of Jizzy, they're not. Right. Here comes the challenging part. And what is potentially going to be the very challenging part in the case of this mod. <laughs> you never know, it might not be. But the good thing about this part of the mission is you can use any vehicle you want to uh, take out the enemies. And that includes, that's right, motorbikes. But you still have to uh, be in the Pimpmobile when you get to the hotel and also in order to make the mission pass. Long story short, if you lose the Pimpmobile at any point, mission failed. I'm not using that to chase them. Oh fuck me. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> That's like an... An APC. Yeah, that's a brand new tank. If I was to make a guess, I'd say it's called an uh, APC. It's probably similar to the Noose APC from the Baldegate Tony. Right. Um, you know, I, uh, I was thinking about this mission earlier on, and I was uh, thinking of. Um, sh yeah, they do have gunners in the APC. Yeah, I was thinking about uh, shooting the driver in the face. But uh, I don't know if you can do that when it comes to uh, coaches. Hold on, let me park it over here instead. Ow! What the hell was that? Hold on. Just a minute. I don't want that! Oh, oh, you got three stars as well, buddy hell. Fucker pushed my bike out of the way. No bend. Right, hold on. It's a coach. It can't go that quickly. Lost a wheel, fuck sake. Hold on. Get up. Jesus, the fucking aggressive as hell. Get off me. My days. Ouch. Okay. And I'm thinking about uh, buying a safe house in uh, Chinatown to uh, save me a trip. See, this is why I hate this mission. It's one of my least favourite missions in this game. And the Preacher section of the mission is precisely why. Another reason is because it's fucking long. How much does it cost this time? Yeah, I had a funny feeling it might be uh, 40,000, because in the van vanilla game it's 20,000, so 
It looks like the properties in this mod cost twice as much. Fine. If I'm strapped for cash, I can easily get more money by doing... By either by doing burglar again, or by trying the uh, inside track betting trick. I've never done that in any of my playthroughs. I'll probably just uh, try to do it using the uh, betting shop in Montgomery. I'll save it. The cabin at Fern Ridge. Right. I'm going to see if I can. Uh, Take out that guy who does drive-bys on you from the APC. Because he's uh, always exposed, clearly. Wait, what a strong bitch, huh? I think once he's gone, Every head half and half with us things will be a lot easier. Yeah, I'll do things your Ruka won't. Shame I lost my rocket launcher I'm no slut, but in the I previous recording it. session. Uh -huh. Real Whatever, puto. Well... I couldn't see any other way of getting that portable toilet out of the building. Oh, I hate bulldozers. Something else I hate, this mission. I really hope that bus or coach, whatever the fuck it is, long ass vehicle, isn't bulletproof. And if I had a tank, it'd be a lot easier. Or even a minigun. Right. I'll just run this fucker over, I think. Without running a hern over, of course. Yay. Nice job. Hey, it's CJ. Right, um, I think this time I'll uh, drive around that crap, see what these guys are like. Only a pistol, it's nothing too threatening. Right, careful. I do need the uh, SMG ammo for the next part. You took your time, phone call. Right, now for the tricky part. Pliers. I don't believe that man's ever been to medical school. Okay, I'm not sure why I went this way. It's fine, I can just turn right, right here. Beat the train. Driver 2. Vasquez got one of my men dumped in the trunk of a car. Dickhead. Spring him, Tanner. I seem to remember I used to have a book that had uh, a walkthrough for Driver 2 in it. And uh, for that mission, Beat the Train, it says you have to beat the train through the tunnel. That's impossible. The train gets there before you can. You can, however, you can, however, just uh, smash through that gate in the top left corner of the area, and then you're ahead of it. Right, they turn, uh, yeah, they always turn left there. 
I'm looking out for a motor. Oh. Of course, when I find a motorbike, it's driving a fucking way from me. That's a decently fast car, I guess. Come on. It's a hell and back. What if I tried to burn it? The devil comes to claim his own driver, can't set yourself alight, obviously. Twang. I need to take out that guy who's. Uh... Yeah. Shooting at me from the APC or whatever it is. Yeah. No, I want a motorbike to come along if that's all right with you. Oi, cheeky fucker! I got a brand new saber. Oh god, look at that! Just a minute. Bloody hell! There's a motorbike. Ow! Please. Please tell me I'm not going to lose them. Ow! Ow! Get off! Get off! No! 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 Oh! The bike's still... Fuck sake! Hardest mission so far. I know I've only done it twice, but uh, this is easily the hardest mission so far. And I thought just business was bad. Mine. And you know what? I'm gonna save that in my garage. Oh, and it's CJ, come on. Oh no, I can't. <laughs> That's safe, I think. Got a fucking garage. God. Yeah, so that, uh. New police unit in this mod, the Vice Squad, look alike, is uh, extremely aggressive. Yeah, they're like, uh. The tanks and Vice City stories, they don't stop for you. <laughs> Not even the world's greatest surgeons will be able to get that lump out of her head. I think I made her, I was going to say flatter than pizza, now she's flatter than pavement pizza. Right, you know what? I'm going to speed the mission up until I'm back at the hotel with the preacher and his protection. I want to test something. I'm considering heading back to Los Santos and using either the all-proof saddler or, or the bulletproof Tahoma to help me get past this part of the mission more easily. So I'm going to leave that saber there and we'll see where it is after the cutscene. Yeah, this cutscene. I have a horrible feeling that any vehicle that you take with you before triggering that cutscene will disappear no matter where you leave it. Right, don't get too close, I want to get a... Preferably a... Motorbike. See, I would get something from my garage, but uh, 
all the safe house garages, including the one in Doherty, are too far away from here. And if I try to get them, I'll just, uh, you know, lose them. Right. It's okay, I'm getting three stars anyway. It's no biggie. Just inflict as much damage as possible. I reckon the bus and the tank, by the way, are uh, fireproof this time around. Because I don't think the uh, I don't think they were burning when I tried to hit them with molotovs in the previous attempt. Right. Oh, it's that f fucking vice squad twat again. Ah, no, not right there. Right, hold on. Good shot, right, go, 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 Right, keep going, keep going. Mind the tram. Thank God cops can't lay down spike strips in this mod. Fuck me, you've got a ton of health. Please tell me it's not bulletproof. Tell me it's just got a lot of health and it's not bulletproof. Okay, the tank is miles behind, that's good. What was... Oh, not you again. Hold on. Yeah, they go through here, that's fine. I have not lost them, unfortunately. I get off. Tell me I've not lost a wheel yet. I think I have, unfortunately. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Where are you? Right, come on. Just get on the bike quickly. Because I've got to continue chasing them. Come on, move! Running out of health and time. Nope. I don't believe it. Hmm. Fine. Plan B. I'm not... Oh, look. A classic banshee. Ow. I'm not going to get a proofed vehicle. Nope. This time I'm just going to... Oh, retro, not classical, whatever. Same thing. I'm not going to attack or provoke the enemies. No. I'm going to just tail them. As in, follow them very slowly and see where they go. Okay. Are you sure? Uh... Well, that safe house has a garage, and it's not that far from the hotel. Hmm. Do me a favour, don't ask. Might just have to try and get the bus uh, stuck somewhere and blow it up with a grenade or something. It's probably fucking explosion proof as well. But I think if you do follow them for long enough, they do eventually just drive into the water. I think. Right, I will speed the video up again until we're back at the hotel. Right, so the safe house is there. The 
this is the hotel. And you can go a fair distance away from the preacher and his protection before you lose them. Well, just the preacher, that is. So I probably could um, make a mad dash up to that safe house after buying it, of course, and grabbing whatever's in there, specifically a proofed vehicle. Well, I still actually have to put a proofed vehicle in there, of course, and buy it as well. But I ain't got the money for that because I think uh, in the vanilla game, <clears throat> that safe house costs 100 grand. So it'll probably be 200 grand in this mod. Um, I will have to do the inside track betting shop trick to uh, get enough money. But I want to uh, follow them slowly on this attempt and see where they go. Uh oh. Well, I've not gone close enough to the bus to uh, provoke the preacher yet. Right, let me grab a bike just very quickly. Oh, hold on. Oh, is he dead? Yes. Good. Right, quickly get on the bike. Bike, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What are they doing back there? Yeah, I would attack them now, but uh, the cops will just come along and get me. So are they just simply unable to get up that hill? Uh, I think he's got a couple more hills to get up as well. Yeah, no, they, they just keep falling back down again. I can get the gunner that's in that. Uh, hold on. What about. Are they pot proof? Those tyres. They probably are, yeah. See, if I had explosives, this would be a lot easier. Hmm. And you know, given that that door on that tank is open, I might actually be able to uh, hijack it if I'm very quick. Hold on. Right, I'll let them roll down the hill again. And I'll see if I can hijack it. Yeah, I'll... It suddenly dawned on me that I might, just might, be able to hijack the tank. Oh, come on. Come here. Nice. Tyrant, okay. Okay. Now then. Ah, come on. Hold on a minute. Let me just get this up here. I like to think this tyrant is uh, bulletproof. Okay. Just don't flip it upside down for Christ's sake, I've come this far. Right. Yeah, I assume that the only reason the passenger door of this thing was open was because. Uh, um, well, that was the only way to uh, make the uh, gunner shoot at me. And then I suddenly realised, with that door hanging open like that, 
I can hijack it. And I can. Right. Yeah. I like to think by ramming it, I'll yeah, inflict a massive amount of damage on it. You know, similar to the SWAT tank and the uh, Rhino tank. Go on, flip upside down, you know you want to. Yeah, you flip upside down, that's right. See you later, donut munching fuds. Right. Right. Given that its rear bumper is hanging off, it's not damage proof. Luckily, my tyrant appears to be damage proof. I mean, bulletproof, sorry. Yeah. I'm not going to bother shooting it anymore because I think it's bulletproof. Oh, yeah, so I've got to take out the uh, guys who were in the tyrant. Shan't, can't, won't. Okay. Yeah, hopefully I can just uh, shove him into the water. Right. Oh, lucky bastard. Right, those cops back there weren't so lucky. Get it right, they're donut munching fuds. Go on, I hope you end up in the drink. You guys too. Ugh. That smoke. Um, come on, come on, come on, get out of the way, get out of the way, I'm gonna lose them. Oh, no, 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 no! No, go! Move! Come on. Come on, come on, come on. I don't fucking believe it. Just one question. Ow. I just want to test to see if this thing is actually bulletproof or not. Yeah, I think it is. Right. I didn't think he was gonna get away that easily. Holy shit. Yeah, forget just business. This right here is easily the mission of the playthrough. Now, given the route that they take, I might have time to uh, go to the pain spray to lose my wanted level. But I'm not so sure. Right, I'm just gonna have to follow them again until they get to um, that hill that I can steal the APC. I mean, Tident. Same thing. Before I rescue the hole, I'm going to make a quick trip to ammunition to see if uh, I can use grenades or satchels to uh, take out that bus. Hopefully. Right, be quick about it. Right, satchels. That is way too steep. Fuck that. Perfect for killing, pure and simple. The war's 
Yeah. It's a shame I spent all my uh, rocket launcher ammo. Right. Get a move on. I think I'll get on the freeway to uh, get there more quickly. And it's buggered off for some bizarre reason. Okay, there's this one. Aha! Right. Uh -huh. Bye! Right, quickly. Just don't fall off, okay? This probably isn't going to work. I think she's going to die. Come on. I've wasted too much time. I should have picked them up on the, on the way back to the hotel instead. No, I've not made it. I've not made it. Oh, yeah, this is where they uh, got stuck last time and uh, where I was able to uh, steal the tyrant. Fingers crossed I can do it again. Yeah, f you know, fingers crossed they just keep sliding back down the hill, allowing me to hijack the tyrant, yeah. That gunner can't shoot for shit. <laughs> Just don't get too close. Don't flip over though. I want I want that vehicle. Hold on. Oh. You don't help. Get away, get away, get away. If you get too close to the coach, the driver takes off. Right, that gunner is dead. Don't tell me the gunners keep respawning. Hold on just a minute. I'm not going to go again to the passenger door. Oh hell. Look what they just did. Yes. They got away. Shit. Fine, I'll continue to tail them and see where they go. With any luck they'll get stuck somewhere else. <laughs> I doubt it somehow. That way. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Hold on. Oh. Hold on a minute. 
so close. For some reason, CJ wants to get in the driver's seat. I'll get the land stalker. I, I thought there was a passenger in it. Oh, no, a fucking bike comes along. Okay, there's one here. Oh! He's crashed again. Forget it. Every time I try to get in the tank, CJ just wants to get in the driver's door, and that's locked. I wouldn't be surprised if it's explosion proof as well as in the bus. Well, the gunner in the Titan is dead. If he wasn't, he'd be, he'd be shooting me by now. We're almost out of the city. I think you'll find my good sir. It's not a car, it's a fucking bike. Get your eyes tested. I mean, if I was able to shoot the driver out of both the bus and the Tyrant, that would be amazing. But I just don't think that's possible somehow. Right. Come on. Whoa, Jesus. I'm thinking about just uh, chasing after it now. God, he really speeds ahead. Maybe he just uh, ends up driving into the water accidentally anyway. Uh, now I can see why I lost him during the previous attempt. Yeah. I reckon if I... Even if I was in the Titans at this point, I'd probably still lose him. Go on. Drown yourself. Have an early bath, you know you want to. And don't forget to wash behind the ears. Yeah, I think they turn back at some point. Well, sometimes. I think sometimes they drive into the water, other times they just turn back and head back to San Fierro. They might drive into the water just now, actually. I think I saw this happening in a video a while ago. Yeah, what happens if you follow the preacher? I think he does eventually just drive off the cliff into the water. Where are we? Fucking hell. Yeah, what is going on here? <laughs> I've still got to get back to the pimp mobile as well. Oh, good. There we go. Good. So, after all that, I just had to follow them. Fair enough. And it looks like his protection have uh, killed themselves too, so uh, I'm just going to head back to uh, the pimp mobile, I think. Uh, where did I even leave that? Oh, where the hell did I leave the pimp mobile again? I mean, they're dead. Hope the mission's not glitched out. Why is the pimp mobile not showing on the radar? What if I get off the bike? Hmm. That's worrying. I can't even remember where I left it now. Mm. Hope it's not glitched out. Well, 
Unless maybe you have to do the killing. Or maybe I've got to uh, trigger the three star water level by provoking them. Um, did I not leave the pimp mobile in southwest San Fierro? I might have done. If I have to get a helicopter and uh, fly above the city, I will. Provided I can get one, that is. Where did I even get this bike from? Yes, I think I uh, left the pimp mobile to then get on this bike somewhere around here. That's not it. Bloody hell. It would help if it was marked on the radar. Here actually. No. Hold on. I'll check the footage, see if I can find it in that. Okay, I'm back. Right. I left the pimp mobile around about uh, here somewhere or here upon reviewing the footage. That's where I discovered I'd left it. But given that it's not uh, marked on the radar, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, getting in it isn't going to make the mission end. Right, just about to turn here. And the mission hasn't failed because, um, you know, yeah, safe houses aren't appearing on the radar. So. Upon watching the footage, I remember that I picked up an ambulance from around here. Oh. I'm sure I just left it here. Let me check it again. Well, folks, I hate to say it, but for some goodness knows why reason, the pimp mobile has inexplicably vanished into thin air. So, unfortunately, I have to start the mission all over again. Right, this time I'm just going to follow the preacher while remaining in the pimp mobile for the entire duration of the chase, shall we say.
you go up there before, why can't you do it again? <sighs> this is ridiculous. Well, the bus just isn't going to drive up that hill, unfortunately. So I've got no choice but to do this. Sorry, folks. Don't worry, girl. The Lord's army will come to our aid. Now just keep on dressing. That's right. Put your hand there. See, I would go to the pain spray, but I haven't got enough time. Yeah, I'll just lose the preacher if I do that. Get off. Oh no, no. Look who it is. them. Just try and stay one step ahead of them. Yeah, I don't want to abandon the Pimpmobile because uh, it might disappear if I do that. Something went boom. Hope it was the uh, Vice Squad cheetah. Nice red pizza stain right there. Hasn't pavement pizza stain, sorry. <laughs> pavement pizza stain. Right, hopefully once I'm in the countryside. Come on, just get on the corner, come on. Right, almost there, come on. Yeah, thankfully the Pimpmobile has increased health, but it's not going to last. Oh no, it's not going to last with them on my tail. Yes, the Vice Squad just came back again, everybody. Oh, I think I've... No! No, 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 no! 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 Fuck you, Megacop! Fucking bastard fuck known as a Megacop did that. Hold on. Go on, go away, go away. You go away too, come on, fuck off. Fucking sad little shite bag in the way. Urgh. Right, just keep going. And just pray that he drives into the water, okay? And pray that you don't get knocked in. I've never liked this mission. Oh good, down to two stars, that's fine. Let's turn the heat down a wee bit. Which means the cops will be a bit less aggressive now. Go on. Please drive into the water like he did last time. And Pimpmobile, please don't- oh god. The Vice Squad is still on my tail, I think. And Pimp Beal, please don't vanish. Well, it shouldn't, because I'm, I'm in it. I'm in it. It shouldn't vanish. Right, is there not a pain spray that I can use in Angel Pine? I don't think there is. So I would quite like to use it. And I want to at least get rid of my stars. <gasps> ah! Come on, 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 come on! Go, 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 go! spawned right in my face. Seriously, they did. Right in my face. That's why you shouldn't look behind too often. Come on, please don't lose them. Okay, it's okay, I'm catching up. Kinda. Right, okay. I don't believe this mission. I genuinely don't believe this mission. Right. I'm going to get some grenades. 
I just can't see any other way of doing this. I mean, the problem is... The, the, well, there's several problems with this mission. One, if you go too far away from the Pimpmobile, it just seems to vanish. Two, if you don't provoke the Preacher to make him drive quickly, he won't get up the hill. Well, he did that one time, but I don't think he will ever again. Where the hell am I going? I thought you said you were going to get grenades. Um, my head's all over the place. Um, yeah, so if I think the surefire way to make sure he gets over the hill is by provoking him, but then... I get three stars, and the cops are just notoriously aggressive this time around. Will you get out of my way, every fucking buddy? Every fucking buff, fucking D, fucking E. Yeah, I reckon this is going to be the mission of the entire playthrough. So nothing wants to go right for me in this mission with this mod. Right. I'm not getting satchels. All virtually legal and above board. Works well in a crowded area. How much do you bet? It's not explosion proof after all this. Just to really piss me off. Right, I'll get the bikes ahead back quicker. Give me that bike. Sony Molotovs. So have to make do without you then. Right, I'll see you later folks, again. Right, now's my chance to see if it's explosion proof or not. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Shit. I was hoping that wouldn't happen. Well, at least I managed to get it up the hill. But, the cops are on my ass. And very soon the that vice squad cheetah will come after me as well. Just you wait. We 
Yeah, I think I see it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. That's gonna get us far ahead of that vice squad sheet as possible, so it must be explosion proof then. Whoa. Explosion proof and bulletproof and fireproof, but not damage proof. Hmm. I think I'll just cut through the alley to. Yeah, cut through the alleys to be safe from the law enforcement for now. Uh, uh, emphasis on for now. God. Ow. 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 Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh no. Look who's here. Piss off, 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 piss off. If anybody wants to tell me how many times I said piss off right there, feel free. No. Yeah. Uh oh. Right. Just, I would avoid looking behind you. If you have to, just do it only very, very occasionally. Just don't get too far ahead of the bus either, or you will lose it. Good, right. That should hopefully make the vice squad cheetah bugger the hell off forever. Right, go on, Bobcat. You need to bugger off too. I really hope this is the successful attempt. I'm sick to the back bloody teeth of this mission. I truly am. <laughs> on Tahoma. I've got a better Tahoma than you back in LS. On. in GSF turf. Well, what is now Ballas turf, unfortunately. Yeah, just stay just a wee bit ahead of that bus. Okay. That way I won't lose it. Right. Um, which way does he go? Does he just keep going? Uh, I think he just keeps going straight along here. Doesn't he? Uh, yes, actually. Right, foot down. Keep on his tail. What the hell is that car doing? Oh! Oh, I so thought he was going to go in the water to my right. No such luck. Right, if I stay in the middle. Right. I've lost him here too many times. He was hoping it's not going to happen ever again. So it's a lose my two stars as well. Come on, go in the water, you know you want to. He's, he's never gone this far away from San Fierro without driving into the water. Something's got to give. Let the bodies hit the floor. And let the bus hit the water. Right. The cops are still behind me. In front of me as well. Come on. It's a shame you didn't, you didn't end up in the water back there, you know, when I thought he was, I honestly thought he was going to end up in the drink, but he managed to wriggle free. Please don't go straight on. Okay. He's probably going to head back to San Fierro now. Oh no, he's going through fucking Red County. <laughs> Bloody hell. 
Well, there's still, well, not as much water as before, but still a wee bit of water that you could potentially drive into. Hopefully if I drive around enough, my two stars will go down to one star. Yeah. And with any luck, he might even flip himself upside down and blow himself up there. One star, thank God. Right. Oh, and the dog's at it again. As in my upstairs neighbour's dog. Are you sure this thing's bulletproof? But I'm not abandoning the pimp mobile. So it'll probably just vanish. Right, I hope you drive off the edge accidentally and flip upside down. There's probably an easier way to do this mission with this mod, but I'm not aware of it. I mean, if I had a tank, that would be that would make things a lot easier. I mean, I would get the tyrant, but uh, I just think if I go too far away from the pump, maybe a little vanish. We saw that happening. Well, to be fair, in that attempt I was using a bike, but I wasn't in the pump maybe I'll so, uh, <laughs> say no more. Come on. I mean, it's not bulletproof in the vanilla game. And it's also not a co- Oh! Oh, hell. Please don't lose him. Oh, just finally right they died okay now I'm gonna very carefully head back into San Fierro get this thing repaired as well okay just don't destroy this after all this please right let's get to that pain spray not far from my garage in Doherty okay uh, yeah. well yeah could go this way. God, I've been on this mission for way too long. Let's let's get something new. Come on, please. Something new. If you please. Jeez. Well, I, was, I was going to um, talk more about this mission, but uh, I probably shouldn't because it's not even over yet. Oh, bloody hell. Shit. Right, come on, go. Drive. Get off as far away from that as possible. Okay. I'm in a quicker vehicle. Get out of the way! All it takes is for one pedestrian bounce to flip this thing upside down. <clears throat> Arse. Right, come on. Pain spray. No. Just go. And to make sure I get there safely, I'm going to just take the road to get up there and watch out for trams. Fine, I'll see them coming, don't worry. Just get this thing repaired. I'm fed up of uh, <laughs> living on the edge during this mission. Right, fingers crossed nothing else glitches out. Good. Ah, there we go. There we go. Hi, train. Ah, oh, big smoke. You're missing yourself. I almost flipped the fucker over. Now then, let's see. Okay, they're not too far from the airport. Right, so I think what I gotta do is wait for the Tyrant to get stuck somewhere, right? And then just haul the passenger out and then kill both him and the driver. Right. What exactly are they doing? Uh, fucking about, clearly. Right, I'll just, uh, uh, and they're just driving around in a big, big ass circle. That's all they're doing. Right. They're just going to keep doing that because uh, they've got no preacher to protect anymore. Ok, 
Okay. At least I'm, I'm being prompted to get back in the pimp mobile now. I need to um, see if I can like, use some kind of vehicle to get that stuck somewhere. But it's not going to be the pimp mobile. Oh no, no, no. That's a death sentence. Just don't get run over by it. You know, they are edging closer and closer to the water. Yeah, they seem to be getting closer and closer to that water. Let me just get back in the pimp mobile. So avoid getting shot, obviously. Come on, guys. I'll, uh, I'll leave the pimp mobile just over here. As long as it doesn't get shot by a stray bullet. Yeah, see if I can entice them over here. If I could entice them into a tree, that would be even better. I want to try and yank the passenger out. I'm just a bit concerned that if I... Whoa! Oh, well, moment of truth now, guys. Oh, that mission. <laughs> Bloody hell. Jeez. To say that was a tough one is an absolute understatement, and I probably won't get the autosave until I'm out of my car. Hold on. There we go. That's what I thought. Yeah. It's just like a Titan Vice and Thrice. You don't get the autosave until you get out of your vehicle. Yeah, that's how it works. It's just like in this mod. And that's that's what it's like in this mod as well, yeah, sorry. I can't talk. Oh, I'm just still trying to get over that uh, hard as hell mission. Yes, it was difficult for a plethora of reasons. One, the bus was bulletproof, fireproof, and explosion proof. Um and it looks like if you go too far away from the pimp mobile, it just disappears off the face of the earth. And you get three stars. Once you uh, provoke the preacher. And provoking the preacher is the only way to uh, get him up that hill reliably. Right, I'll take this phone call, then I'll save again, then BRB. Cool, right, I'll do uh, T Bone Mendez, bugger off, guys. Yeah, the next mission will be T Bone Mendez, because I want to use that rifle. Right, BRB, folks.